Hi, welcome back. In this video tutorial, I will discuss how to use Selenium and Python programming language for automation testing. In this introductory video, I will discuss uh, what is Selenium, how to install Python package, how to install PyCharm IDE and how to create a simple Python project in PyCharm IDE. First, we will see what is uh, Selenium. Selenium is an open source and portable automated software testing tool for testing web application. It has a capability to operate across uh, different browsers and operating systems. That is, uh, the Selenium can be used on different browsers like uh, Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, Firefox and so on. It can work on different uh, operating systems like uh, Windows, Mac OS and Linux operating systems. Selenium is not just a single tool, it contains a set of tools so that uh, the testers can automate the web applications more efficiently. The first uh, tool of uh, Selenium is uh, Selenium IDE. Selenium has its own ID that is Integrated Development Environment. It comes as a Firefox uh, plugin so that uh, we can write Selenium scripts and uh, test the web applications. Selenium web driver is used to send the commands directly to the browser and retrieve the results from the browser. We can write the test scripts in uh, different uh, programming languages like Java, C Sharp, PHP, Python, Ruby and Perl. The third component of uh, Selenium is uh, Selenium Grid. Selenium Grid is a tool used to run parallel tests across different machines and different browsers uh, simultaneously which results in minimizing the execution time. That is uh, whenever you ha have a very large number of test cases you can run the test cases parallelly across uh, different machines and different uh, browsers simultaneously with the help of uh, Selenium Grid. Now uh, we will try to understand uh, how to set up an environment so that we can write Python scripts and uh, automate the testing. So first we will try to understand how to install uh, Python package. So if you want to install Python package, go to the browser and uh, search for uh, Python. Once you search for Python, you will get uh, the different results. On the first results, you will get uh, the download tab here. Once you click on uh, download tab, you will get uh, the latest version of Python. Below you can see there were different uh, operating systems are listed. Based on your operating system, you can select it. In my case, I have selected uh, Windows here. Now uh, you need to click on this particular download Python 3.10.6. This is the current or uh, latest uh, version in this case. So once you download it, uh, usually it will be available in your downloads uh, folder. Just double click on this particular exe. Here uh, it has some different options. The first one is install now and uh, customization. At the below you can see two check marks. Uh, the first one is uh, by default checked, but the second one is not checked. So you need to select this particular uh, check mark and then you need to click on this uh, install now. And one more very important thing is you need to remember this particular path. This is the path where the Python is installed in your machine. If you want to change it, you can change it. But uh, I prefer the default location for this particular installation. Once you click on this uh, install now, uh, it will take some time based on your uh, computer speed. And then you will get a message like uh, setup was successful. So this is a very simple process uh, you can follow so that you can install Python package in your machine. Next, we need to install an IDE. Uh, in my case, I'm using uh, PyCharm. And this is the IDE which is used in industry uh, by almost all companies. So go to again browser and search for Python, PyCharm in this case. You will get different uh, options here. Uh, click on uh, download PyCharm. You will get this particular home page. On the home page you have a download button here. So once you click on this download button, you will get two options and the different uh, operating systems were listed. Based on different uh, your choice, you need to select uh, a particular operating system here. Uh, professional is a paid version. You will get 30 days uh, trial uh, for this one. Better you can uh, click on this uh, community version because it supports uh, the Python uh, 
uh, as well as uh, selenium scripts over here so click on this particular uh, download button uh, you will be able to download the pie chart once the pie charm is uh, downloaded it will be available in your uh, downloads folder click on uh, pie charm community edition uh, exe file click on next here and then you need to select the destination folder uh, better to go with uh, the default uh, folder in this case click on next click on next click on install based on your computer uh, speed it will take some time to install after that it will ask you to uh, either reboot now or manually reboot later so better to reboot your machine once you reboot your machine uh, you will be able to uh, use this particular pycharm community edition uh, successfully so in this video uh, i have discussed uh, what is uh, selenium uh, what are the uses of uh, selenium and uh, how to set up the environment to write uh, uh, the selenium scripts in python programming language that is uh, installing python package as well as uh, installing a pycharm ide in the next video we will discuss how to create a simple uh, project in pycharm and uh, how to install selenium on the top of pycharm ide and then uh, we will discuss uh, how to write uh, the selenium scripts in python programming language i hope uh, the concept is clear if you like the video, do like and share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.